Hey y'all, welcome to the channel. My name's Melanie, I am not Nathan. If you didn't guess or if you don't know, today we are playing the Sims 4 Legacy Challenge on short lifespan. If you've missed any of the parts that we have done, I will put the info card up so that you can click the playlist. I did finally figure out that it's on this side, not on this side. I have been getting confused, but anyways, it'll be up there on this side right here. In fact, it'll be here right now. Wow. Magic, I tell ya. I have been doing some adjusting, different camera angle. I'm gonna be facing this way, so we're gonna see if I hate it or if I like it. But uh, for now, this is what we're working with. <laughs> I do eventually wanna try and use my green screen, but the way that my windows are, it would like, with the lighting and stuff, I need to focus on my lighting first before I work with my green screen, but that's probably boring for you. You probably don't care about that kind of stuff. Last time Liana became a teen, Kevin uh, finished his second term of classes. He only did two classes for that semester. So this time I figured we'd try three for his third semester and then he'll only have three for his fourth semester, hopefully to balance the load a little bit uh, because I felt like two was easy, honestly, and four was too much. Four, there was a lot going on, but we are playing short lifespan, so we only have so long for him to finish school before he's dead. So also if you hear my dog crying in the background, I promise she's okay. She is a hound dog and a catahoula specifically. And so she talks a lot. She's not in pain. She was just outside. Like she's fine. She just cries. Anyways. <laughs> Hydrate yourself. I played just a little bit off camera. I think it was only like a day's worth in Sims time um, just to get Liana's room updated. So it's a little bit more of a teen room rather than a kid's room. I brightened up the walls and then I've been working a little bit on Kevin with a Y getting a promotion. And that's one of the goals for today. Um, and then also Liana made some new friends. Uh, they moved in across the street and there was a single mom with a family next door. They met and they're buddies now. And so uh, we might be seeing a little bit more of the neighbors. For this part, I wanna focus on um, Kevin with a Y's promotion. And I want Kevin with an I to finish uni before he's dead. So I feel like that's a pretty valid goal. <laughs> I want Liana to become a young adult and I obviously wanna find her a man's. Who knows, maybe one of the neighbor boys will be one of her man's. Let's find out. <laughs> oh, and also if you're new here and you didn't feel like watching the other parts, which I recommend that you do, but if you didn't, um, our queen here is red because she's an alien and our boy Kevin over here is green because he's an alien. So in case you were confused as to why uh, their skin colors are weird, that is why, but don't be racist. Jeez. I want her to make more friends just in case the neighbor kids are not working out for us. Maybe they don't get along. So, or maybe they're just friends, you know? So to give her some options, we'll have her make friends at school. Okay, so he's got class in six hours. He needs to, excuse me, do his homework for that. He did one bit of homework, but it wasn't the right homework. So what a nerve. That's the homework we need to do. Kevin, go do your homework right now. So as you can see over here, I updated Liana's bedroom a bit. Why does he want to use her desk? That's fine, I don't care. Um, I updated the room over here a bit, got her a cute new bed, lit up the walls a little bit, gave her some a desk for homework and decor. I did hire a one-time maid just because we have a little bit of money, which, okay, in case anybody's like, where did that money come from? You cheated. I swear that I did not. We rummaged through the decor box and I sold the decorations from it um, to make just a little bit of extra money. I feel like that's cheating. So like, I don't want to do it all the time. I just wanted to do it to get enough money to do the bedroom. And I didn't realize how like, how much money I got for the decor. So some of it I saved, like two pieces I saved. Oh, I thought I put one in here, but I guess I didn't. Um, so anyways, I saved some of it so that I didn't make unnecessary money. I thought about taking some of that money off, but then I was like, no, cause I feel like that really is cheating. So anyways, I mean, I feel like that's a legit thing. You could in real life, um, Did you see that? Lightning just struck my chest table. How is that not on fire? 
No, you can't come over, Tamika. I know you're gonna die, but you can't come over. Okay, so we got his homework done. I remember what I was talking. Oh, I feel like in real life, you would pull out like your Christmas decorations or your summer decorations, or at least I do. And I'll go through stuff and I won't always use everything. And I feel like after a couple of years, you'd go, well, I haven't used this. Maybe I should sell it. You know what I mean? So, or I don't like this anymore. This isn't my taste. So as much as it's cheating, I feel like it's also realistic because in real life, if someone was to pull out their decor boxes and go through them, they might be like, oh, I don't want this anymore and then sell it. So anyways, I, again, I don't want to do that all the time. If I'm in a pinch, I want to, I want to actually like work for my money, but I figured it was not a big deal to hire a one-time maid just to make sure everything is in tip top shape. Invite over classmate Carly. Sure. Who's classmate Carly? Classmate Carly has, that's Kira Hilton. Where's Carly? This is Carly. Oh wait, Carly, she's, so she's actually one of the neighbor kids. That's really funny. She brought her home from school. So Carly is one of the neighbor kids. Um, in fact, why don't I tell you a little bit about the neighbors? So it's a single mom. She's got a few kids. I think there's four, um, two boys. There's the older son. And then there is the younger son and the twin sister. This is his twin sister here, Carly. And then there is the younger sister. I can't remember all their names right now, um, but they moved just across the street. Do we want Liana to go to college? I think we should think about that. I don't know if I want her to or not. It's a lot, but if it's what she wants, I forgot, what does she want? She wants to be a max or mix all, mix, a master mixologist. So, you know, we should look at our options and just see, um, just see what they offer. Cause I don't know. Can you go to school for mixology? I don't even know. I feel like culinary arts is mixology. No. So maybe she should look into the Foxbury Institute because maybe she would want to go. Maybe she just wants, cause you know, like for me personally and my jobs and the career path I wanted to take, it was like, I could have gone to college. Um, I feel like college is always beneficial, but at the same time with my job, I have also learned a lot just by being thrown into it. So I don't necessarily know that bartenders go to college to be bartenders, but any little bit of education that she could get would probably be helpful. I don't know, we'll think about it. Kevin's home. So he needs to do his homework for forest pathology. Did he put his homework in his inventory? Do homework for forest pathology. Um, and then she needs to do her homework. Oh, and Kevin with a wise home. Hello, my dear. You know what I just realized? She got a promotion. <laughs> nice. <laughs> I totally was not paying attention, but she did. Kevin did get a promotion, so that's good. We're making a little bit more money. I'm going to go ahead and apply Liana for university. Just sitting here, I feel like I have made the decision. She should go. Why not? Try something. Follow in her dad's footsteps. Who knows? Maybe we'll even go physically to university. I don't know. I'm kind of thinking about it. Oh, I think the lightning did hit my chest table. <laughs> oh no. Okay, well, it is what it is. Nice. <laughs> Maybe we should buy a mixology table because initially I was like, we don't have the money. She's just a teenager. But now I'm like, well, but now I'm thinking we do have the money. So we could go ahead and just do it. Where should we put this actually? Maybe what I'll do is I'll move the computer desk and then we'll put the mixology table like in the corner. Oh, he, of course he broke the computer. Hire repair service. You know what? I feel like we're making consistent enough money. We should just hire um, a cleaner. That's my personal opinion. And if it ends up being too expensive, we can get rid of her, but I feel like she won't, wouldn't be doing that much on a daily basis that we could afford that. Cause my Sims just leave plates everywhere, which when I see them, I try to do it myself. 
but it doesn't always work. And then the bathtubs and stuff, they end up breaking because they forget to clean them, which, real life, am I right? <laughs> Why is she using an umbrella inside? I don't know, it's fine. Carly, you should, like, tell your brothers to come over. Let's invite the guys over, why not? I just realized my camera uh, turned off, but, so Bruno is the twin, Paul is uh, technically the older brother, but in The Sims, you can't, um, you can't give them different ages. Like they're just all teens or they're all ch children or whatever. I personally have, uh, I feel like Bruno, she thinks Bruno's pretty cute. That's what I think. I think she's got a little crush on Bruno, but sometimes just doesn't work out. Sims just don't get along. People just don't get along. So we'll give it a shot. So let's just take this time to get to know him a little bit. <laughs> Hello? So they're just chatting up a storm here. Apologize, what'd you say to him? Oh, see you later, Carly. Carly's leaving. Poor, poor Paul, he's just kind of here. <laughs> Sorry, Paul. I don't know, I feel like their friendship hasn't really like, I don't feel like their friendship has grown a whole lot. They've sat here for like a couple hours now and been visiting. So I don't know. Maybe she'll find someone else at university. Don't want to force it, you know, just like anybody else. All right, the boy's headed home. She's at least established some more of a friendship with them. Man, Kevin's team has been having some good games lately. Man, we've been having some thundery autumn days. Whoa, great. We're going to get a deck because we deserve it. Should I change the layout of the house a little bit? I feel like there's just such an like awkward space here. Okay, we might be doing some remodeling. Please hold. Okay, so I did it. The office space is a little bit awkward. I mean, it's just kind of cramped, but it works. I replaced the other office chair with the one that we had in our inventory. Um, eventually, we'll get her a nicer desk and maybe, maybe she'd have her own office, but I don't know. Eventually, they're going to die, so... I have to think about whether or not it's worth it. Oh, but the chess table, please hold. Welcome back. So here's the situation. I rearranged, I did end up expanding the office a little bit. I actually expanded the living room just a little bit. So we had a good way for a back door to get onto a little tiny deck. Um, then my camera battery died. So I just played off camera for a little bit, basically just taking care of their needs. You probably wouldn't have noticed anyway. Um, so this is what the house looks like now. I also did a little bit of landscaping only in the front, as you can see, <laughs> but uh, did just a little bit, which I feel like I do okay with. So, oh, except don't look there. Um, don't look at that. Anyways, I am pretty sure I had to hire a handyman to come fix my toilet. I am pretty sure the handyman pranked my toilet after fixing it. Cause now there's, it's purple and foaming. So I don't know what that's all about. Um, oh. That doesn't, hold on, that doesn't look good. That doesn't necessarily either, but it looks better than it did. So we're just gonna leave it because it makes your Sims happy to have some decor. Okay, what do you have going on today? He's got class in two hours. I guess nothing wrong with maybe studying because he's already gonna have his last day here in a couple days. So Liana's birthday's today. So Kevin's making a cake. I think I'm gonna have them both blow out the candles and just go ahead and celebrate his birthday early. And then Kevin with a wise birthday is next week. Add birthday candles, please. Aw, she's all dressed up for her birthday. Mm, maybe we should wait like just a second for our friends to show up. Maybe take a quick power nap. Ooh, and I almost had the wrong sim blow out the candles. So Carly's here at least, why don't you go? Oh, there are the boys. Blow out the candles. Ah, I almost missed it. Okay, hold on. Gonna take some pics. She's an adult. Okay, so. Gonna randomize her last trait. Stop. Childish. These Sims gain powerful moodlets from watching the kids network, become playful when playing with children, and become happy when playing with children's toys. Well, you know what? That's cute. I bet that's going to be annoying, but that is cute. Young adulthood. She's a young adult. Yeah. Okay, no, nobody ate the cake. Oh, good. I thought they ate the cake. Now Kevin's going to blow out the candles. 
Carly's just chilling. Oh, broken back. Oh, yeah. Oh, he's a handsome old man. I wonder if he can still play soccer and stuff with university now that he's an elder. I really hope he can finish his term. Maybe I shouldn't have aged him up early. It's probably against the rules, but I didn't... I didn't age her up early. Her, she aged up on her birthday. Well, so now that she's an adult, we should get her a job. They're all sad because that nanny died. <laughs> just so you know. I don't think that was on camera, but just so you know. Actually, you know what? Maybe she should just go into university. Let's apply for scholarships. Okay. Let's try and get the food and drink scholarship. I want to apply for multiple scholarships again. Education for all, because we do not have a lot of household funds. And then Willow Creek. Oh, crap. Final exam for Kevin. Which one? Which one? Shoot. Okay, well, he... I don't think he studied at all. So... Send well wishes for Kevin. Crap. I can't believe I forgot. Actually, yes, I can. Who am I kidding? Does he have time? Maybe he has time. Maybe he can hop on really quick and just do a little bit of a cram session. Scholarship? No. Wait, what are you trying to do? He needs to study forest pathology, right? Yes. So, Liana, get up. Liana! <laughs> get out of the chair! Oh my gosh, get up. <gasps> Please, go study. Please. 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 Please, study. Oh my gosh, he's literally only gonna study for like 10 minutes. He has to go right now. Okay, well, he went. Well, that class is done. Um, all of his homework is done at least. Okay, this one. Flora, land, and sea. So, study for that right now. Please and thank you. He's got to go to class already. I really hope he passes because homeboy's at the end of his life. <laughs> she got another promotion. Jeez, this woman. She's just boss lady. Okay, so he passed. At least. Um, he got A plus, A plus, and then a D plus. So. But it's okay. <laughs> he passed. That's what matters. Yes, we want to sign up for another term. Let's get all three done. Okay, his last term has begun. So we're going to start working on his homework now. Oh, of course, the har it's Harvest Fest. <laughs> Kevin's class starts in an hour, so he better have his freaking homework done. Wait, why does he have class on Harvest Fest? I thought they had work and classes off. Well, that's a bummer, isn't it? Holiday grand meal. What do you have for Thanksgiving? Uh, for Thanksgiving, we usually do turkey and ham. I know some people are like, turkey's for Thanksgiving, ham is for Christmas. But like, my family has always done both. So there's a deal on this. Hmm. Interesting. I just hit turkey. That's okay. Turkey is for Thanksgiving anyway. Oh, and she just peed her pants. Nice. Call everyone to a grand meal. What a chaotic Thanksgiving. Oh, she's so gross. Go take a bath. What? Why are you? Well, that was silly of you. <gasps> Maid, quit. Oh, stop it right now. This is a wonderful Thanksgiving. I love spending time with you. Bye, Kevin. Hope you got your homework done. Bruno's calling. Hey, Liana. Paige Crawley's asked me out on a date. Should I say yes? He's asking me? See her in the bottom corner there? She's like, dude, I had a crush on you. Why are you asking me? He's probably like, you're a college woman now. Think about it yourself. Well, what a bummer. What a bummer of a Thanksgiving. Eventful, though. A bummer, but eventful. Well, can't think of any other way to end this. So what better than to end it on the most chaotic holiday 
I've ever had. Thank you so much for joining me today. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, you should hit the like button. Um, if you haven't already, there's a bell icon when you hit subscribe, you should click the bell icon because the reason for that is because then you get notified whenever we upload, which is every Friday. So just saying, in case you forget, you don't want to miss, you don't want to miss this top tier content. Yeah. Anyway, thanks for joining me. I'll see you next time. <laughs> Bye.